Hello guys, and I hope whatever you're watching this, you're having a fantastic day. I woke up today to the news that the Skip Barber series are racing around Spa, and with Spa being my favorite track, absolute yes from me, first of all. And I kind of want to try and do a last two whatever challenge, hopefully a last to first challenge, obviously, but I, I want to see how far we can get up. So for this one, we're not going to be qualifying, we're just going to go in wherever the game sticks us. I believe we are... Yeah, oh, well, we're the number three car, so whoever doesn't qualify will probably be on top of them, so we won't quite be at the back, but we can probably start from the pits, actually. Nah, we'll just start from the grid. But yeah, so nine laps around Spa. We're gonna be probably going around for a while, because these things are not the fastest cars in the world, so <laughs> it'll take probably a while, but, um... From the back, try to get up as far as we can. I think it'll be a fun time. Let's uh, let's get to the grid. So about only a third of the grid qualified, uh, and we're starting 10th. Not quite last, so what I'm going to do, once we start, we're going to pull over and let everyone pass. We could, I guess, in theory, start from the pit lane, but I, uh, I don't want to. All right, here we go. The four LED red lights are on. Green, green, green. A decent start, but we gotta let everyone pass. Let's hope we don't get taken out. It's happened before. All right, we're good. Let's go. That's a nice little pink, uh, <laughs> little pink car up there. Oh, someone's already around. It's an old school uh, Williams there. Oh, his his wheel was gone, and it just <laughs> it just popped back on. All right. I could have those powers. Now, I haven't done many laps in the Skip Barber around here. I've only really done it around Charlotte. The, uh, the Roval. Oh my god. Oh my god. That man just died. Okay. They're dead. As I was saying, I really haven't done any laps in the Skip Barber around here, so I'm not the fastest guy. But I think we'll get faster as the race goes on as we uh, figure out what the car likes and doesn't like. I don't even know where we're at right now. Oh, that's a bit deep. Ah, uh, <laughs> okay. This guy behind us, I think, is a lot faster than us. He might have got tangled up with the incident on lap one. Well, one of the incidents in lap one. And he's out of position, but... We'll find out. He might just be past the pursuit. That's, that's always a possibility. Stay on the right. I'll let him go through. I don't want to go side by side to Blanchemont. In a car, I have no faith in its grip. He's going to go defensive. Really late. So we can say to slip street and come back at him a little bit. You're in the top ten. I'm in the top ten apparently. Oh, that's a little deep. So we started, I believe we started ten. Dropped all the way back to last. Did the first lap, and now we're back up to eighth. Right on this guy's gearbox. Oh, he's sideways. Please don't hit me. I think we're side by side at the moment. Can't see him though. Oh, there he is. He's gonna send it up here, I can feel it. Clear on the right. That's a nice paint job though, isn't it? Car right. Keep to the left. Clear. Oh, he's really good under brakes. And just carrying speed. <laughs>
They break biases a little too far back, I think. One thing I've noticed with these cars around here, I think it's around any track, they like getting driven with the rear wheels. Like, it's okay to get a little bit of a slide. That's how they enjoy it, you know? So different to any other open wheel. I do want to stay in the back of this guy, though. I'm trying to learn from his lines a little bit. Interesting line he took. Let's see if we can get into slipstream here. I I think we might be a little far back. We might have gotten a better exit. Him getting on the grass is going to help us too. Oh, that's so scary, dude. You can feel the front end just get so light through there. That's an off-track. This is also, fun fact, this is also my first time ever driving Spa in iRacing. And I've heard a lot of the horror stories about the track limits and... Oh god. It's a bit late. Another, uh, another off-track? Alright. But yeah, I hear a lot about the horror stories of the off-track penalties around Spa and iRacing, so I'm... Very glad I get to experience that first hand. <laughs> Let's keep it flat. Oh, easy flat. Okay. I was worried it would just get too squirrely, but it's... It's, it's a little bit more planned through there than you think. It drives like a go-kart. I feel like that's the best way to describe it. It drives like a go-kart. That's the impression I'm getting from it, anyway. This is the second lap in a row we've gained a tenth on him in this straight, this back straight. But I think we get a better exit than him there, but he pulls away from us uh, uh, everywhere else. <laughs> it's alright though. It's alright. That was a little better on the brakes. Could break a little bit later, I think. This could be an off track. No! Okay. Alright, go-kart strats, boys. I don't think it works. I think that's the first time we've gotten the source right. <laughs> He's still pulling away from this. I guess our only hope is going to be learning to be faster, <laughs> I guess. We're in the 54s right now for our lap time, so I don't think that's very good. I think I saw people in qualifying that were towards the back were doing 52s. We're kind of stuck in no man's land right now, aren't we? Oh god, that's wide. That's very wide. But yeah, we're gonna suck in no man's land. The guy in front of us is about five seconds up. He pulls away from us, then we pull him back in, and then he pulls away from us again. And the guy behind is, what, 16 seconds back? 15 seconds back? We need to hope this guy in front of us makes a mistake or something. Which I doubt he will. He's been pretty flawless all race. I feel like these cars need a smaller track. This track is really fun in this car, but I feel like for racing, smaller tracks might benefit it. Whoa! Wait! Okay, we have a... 
Possibility now. Still there. Clear on the right. Not lap cars. They might have damage as well. I mean, that guy behind us doesn't have a front wing, so definitely have damage. We're up into sixth now. I think that's the guy that's been locking up a bunch. Just turning in. Okay. I don't exist. You don't need to defend like that, man. Jesus. I hope I don't have damage. Oh, he's slow through there. Still there, hold your line. Had to go off track so I didn't hit him. Stay on the left. Stay on the left. Clear. I cover the inside line. Yeah, they definitely have damage. I mean, they don't have front wings, but... Don't spin now. Well, I think we're up into... Sixth? Or fifth? So that was apparently off track. Jesus Christ, we're up to nine X's. What the hell? That guy hitting us off, or attempting to hit us off, gave us four, so that's never fun. We're going to lose safety rating on that, but. What matters is we're having fun. <laughs> and missing gears. Alright, we pulled out two laps ago. Okay, we got three seconds out on the guys behind us. They're definitely struggling a lot right now. Breaking is so tricky, this thing, dude. For me, anyway. You're in fifth. Okay, yeah, we're in fifth. I think last to fifth with 18 people in the field. Granted, they all kind of took each other out, but. I think last to fifth is pretty solid. We'll see if we can hold it here. That was off track, apparently. Okay. I don't recall going off track. <laughs> I'm scared to run wide there now. <laughs> Alright, all we gotta do is survive one more lap and we'll be fine. Fourth is catching third really fast. I think that's the guy we were behind pretty much all race. Try and break late here, yeah? Probably wait until a uh, practice session, but. You've got about two left of fuel. Okay. Not bad. They still pulled out a lot of time on me, but. Up the red line limiter a little bit. I might get in the 52s here. That'd be nice. So far, I'm shaving like a second and a half off my best time, apparently. Yeah, I have them break by us a little far back, too. Alright, 
believe that's race over. We did get into the 252s. Nice, nice, nice. Great job. You did really well. That was fun. I mean, last to fifth, I think, is pretty solid. I feel like this track's a little big for these cars, but... God damn, it's fun. Well, guys, if you enjoyed this, hit that subscribe button, hit the like button. I'd really appreciate it. I do stream on Twitch pretty much every day around 3.30 uh, Pacific time. I'd love to see you there. Link for all that is in the description. I'll see you for the next video, and uh, stay safe out there, okay? See ya.